Hi, it's that time of the year again. The snow is falling, the sun is setting early, and students have to select their courses for the next school year. Here at EP Media, we understand that this may be a stressful time for you. You may feel overwhelmed by the choices and not know which classes to take. The juniors have to pick courses for their major while they may not even know what that major will be. Trust me, I understand. So let's not make this process more difficult than it has to be once you finally decide on classes. So just sit back, relax, and follow this simple tutorial, and your course selection will be done with no pain and no anxiety. During EP, you will use a course request form in Sapphire to select the courses you plan to take next year before going home and reviewing this request form with your family before finalization. To get to your course request form, log into your student Sapphire account. If you usually use your parents' login information, you'll have to use your own when selecting your courses. If you don't know your Sapphire login, visit the library for assistance. Look in your student backpack on the left-hand side of the screen for the form. Once you click, you'll see some instructions on how to complete the form, as well as information about new courses being offered this year. Give that a read, and then click the Fill Out Course Request Form button. When the form opens, you'll find every course available to your grade level listed, along with how many credits the course is worth. For your core academic courses, your teacher recommendations will be highlighted in green. Courses highlighted in red indicate you have not taken the prerequisite courses to be able to take them. To select a course, click the checkbox to the left of the course name. The total number of credits you've selected automatically tallies for you. You will have to schedule seven credits worth of courses for next year. Some courses have been pre-selected for you based on your teacher recommendations or because they are mandatory grade level courses you need for graduation. You also need to choose at least three alternate courses in addition to your seven requested credits. If there is a course you would like to take that's not listed on the course request form, or if you disagree with a teacher recommendation, or if you cannot schedule a course that is highlighted in red but believe you have taken the appropriate prerequisite courses, select the special request box and write in what you need the school counselors to know about your situation. The school counseling team will be responding to special requests in the next couple of weeks by following up with those students who submitted them. Once you've selected your seven credits of courses, as well as at least three alternates, click Save Course Requests button. You can revise these requests at any point before the end of the day, Monday, February 18th, 2019. The last form you submit will be what is imported into Sapphire, so make sure to save the form and the classes you are sure you want. It's as easy as that. Course selection is over with no hassle. But maybe you haven't decided on classes yet. That's okay, just come back and rewatch this video when you do. If you need help deciding, head over to our video about new electives to see what new classes the school is offering. And feel free to go to the teachers of the classes you are interested in and ask them about the class. They would be more than happy to help you make a decision. And of course, your guidance counselors are always there to help if you need them. So just send them an email or see them in person. Thanks for watching.